Hi uh, everyone, how are you doing? I'm back in Holborn, WC1, and I'm hungry. Yeah, so if you get off Holborn tube station, you're on you're then on High Holborn and just walk along a few minutes and you get to Red Lion Street. Now I've been here before and I walked past this place. It's called Sam's It's called Sam's Chinese Express. And it's a tiny little place but the food looks amazing and it's so cheap. So we're here to take a look. Do you, do you recommend the sweet and sour chicken or the black bean sauce? Both are very nice, they're very good here. Okay. Uh, okay. Decisions. Uh, sweet and sour, thank you. Yeah? I'll sweet and sour, please. So for £8.50, I've ordered the uh, sweet and sour chicken. But you get three spring rolls and a free drink with every meal. I mean, we're in Holborn. It's just literally off Holborn. But I did say in the last vlog, when I was here, that just walking up this street, there's a lot of vlogs here. There's so many great places. And I intend to try them all. Okay, so I went to pay, and I said, cash or card? And he said, either. He said, but cash is cheaper. So cash, eight pounds, not eight pound fifty. Plus a free drink, plus free spring roll. And it's supposed to be amazing. So here I am, gonna try it out. First one here again, because I like to get here early, because this is gonna get busy. It's very small, but who cares about the size of it? Quality food, and it's cheap. Then there's no question in my eyes. And also the gentleman said, um, would you like uh, rice or noodles? I said, can I have both? No problem at all. Damn good. Damn good. Sometimes you know when you know. 
when I walked past this place a little while ago, you see people eating and you see the food and you think, God, it looks and smells amazing. I've got to try it. And then you look at the menu and you see how cheap it is. You think, well, it's a no-brainer, isn't it? You're in the area and you just fancy a, just a, a light lunch or brunch even. Pop in, a quid. Done. On your way and have a move to our London. Do you know what? I don't just say this for the camera, you know. When it's off the charts, it's off the charts. This is definitely off the charts. For a little Chinese treat. Try this place. Sam's Chinese Express. Red Lion Street. some of the best sweet and sour chicken I've had, you know. Seriously. Just, I mean, just a taste sensation. There you go. We've got a special on today as well, spicy beef and shredded crispy beef. So, looks like they have a special every day as well. Well, there you go, Red Lion Street. Just come out from Sam's. Just had a chat with Sam. Just to see if Sam's got it all going on. And he has. What a nice guy. I was just saying that I love promoting small businesses if the food quality is good. And that was good. Um, so good. Uh, so now it's time to have a mooch about. Sam's Chinese Express, they do takeaways as well. Oh look, it's a Thai restaurant. Maybe another day. It's the city that keeps on giving. I've just gone down a little back street, uh, sort my hair out, and uh, found another calf. It's great here, isn't it? They just love London. And then just a five minute walk from Holborn Station. You have this little place, 
small building, but quite famous. Well, if you haven't guessed it yet, this is the British Museum in all its glory. I just love how they make street names so relevant. It's great. Yeah, so if you look on the map, find Museum Street, British Museum's opposite. Nothing can make me back down. So there you go, if you keep walking from Holborn Station past British Museum and keep going, you come to Tottenham Court Road, which is where we are now. But I'm going to end it here because otherwise I'll be walking around for another five hours, which is very easy to do. So yeah, so we wanted to try that uh, Sam's Chinese Express, which was amazing, off the charts as, as I say. Yeah, I, I hope you... Um, can get time to go and have a look because it's just amazing food. So for now, Stan and John, uh, I was in Holborn, but now I'm in Tottenham Court Road, and I'll see you in the next one.